guys, what's up? It's Naomi the Crafty Savage here, and I'm back for the next letter of the day of the ABCs of April, Shay J. Reed style. So today's letter of the day is E, right? So what could E be? It could be elephant, it could be, what else begins? Egg, hmm. What else is E? Egbert? I don't know, I'll probably think of other ones, you know. I'd be like, shh. I should have said that one, but it's all good, right? So this diamond painting comes to us from Rhinestone Goddess Creations. It is the wonderful art by Shay J. Reed of her Alphabet series. With every Rhinestone Goddess Creations kit, you will get your toolkit, which it will come with a pen, a two multi-placer, your tweezers, you get some like the wax, you get a little squishy for your pen. You get baggies inside of a baggies. And that is like, shh, if you know, you know. You get a big mumbo jumbo multi-placer and a boat. It, it is, it is what it is. You will also get your inventory sheet. This is a older inventory sheet. Her inventory sheets are now stickers where you do not have to run this through a Xyron sticker maker. It's already, you know, you just peel them, slap them on your baggies or your containers, whatever it is that you use to work out of when you're diamond painting. It tells you the size of the painting. This painting is a 55 by 85 centimeter. It is a square diamond painting, but if you like this image, you can get it in round as well, right? So it's got 49 colors. It's got three ABs, like, whoo, yes. Now let's take a look at these drills, shall we? Because when I say these drills are like, mwah, like they are just some beautiful square drills. They really are. So as you can see, they already come bagged. There is, I don't see like any little like dimples, like knobbly little bits and pieces hanging off the drills. Like they, they are just absolutely stunning. Look at that AB. If you're new to diamond painting, AB stands for Aurora Borealis. It's just like a little special coating that they put on the drill that just makes them shine and sparkle just a little bit more than the others. What I do also like about Rhinestone Goddess Creations is once you open up your canvas, you get this plastic sleeve that you can store your diamond painting. I have to find the hole. Store the diamond painting in the plastic sleeve, fold it up, you know, with your drills and just store it away. If you store your diamond painting separate from your drills though, which is fantastic. You see this like little code right here, this F9368, I think that's what it says, on your diamond painting, you know, you got the, so that way you know exactly which drills go to which diamond painting. And you're like, yeah, Naomi, that's, that's cute. That's great. Thanks for telling me about that. But before I open this up, I did want to let you know that all of the diamond paintings from Rhinestone Goddess Creations come with a 100% warranty. You get free shipping. You can get them in round or squares with or without ABs. The choice is yours, right? Exactly. Like, I love it. I'm, I'm, I'm here for it. I'm just here for it. So, it comes in this, like, thicker plastic that... Sometimes they're nice. Sometimes they like to like watch me struggle. I think the person who wraps this up, you know, they're like, well, we're gonna mess with her. We're gonna make her struggle with this one. This one was not bad at all. There is also rubber bands, which I don't understand why they rubber band it, but they, they do. It drives me freaking bonkers, but it is what it is, right? So you got a rubber band at the top, yeah, sometimes it's at the bottom. Sometimes it's in the middle. Sometimes there's three, sometimes there's two, sometimes there's one. I don't know, I guess it depends on whoever, you know, box it up and all that. So, 
Every rhinestone goddess creations canvas has a little styrofoam like squishy thing. So when your canvas is rolled up, it will not like squish on itself during mailing, which is fantastic. Her diamond paintings have a silk flocking material that are poured glue. So yes, like when I say these, these paintings are like soft. They're just like so soft. Like I just want to like, I could sit here for hours and just keep doing this. Like, it is so soft and silky. Anywho, you did not come to see me pet the canvas. No, that's that's not what we're here for. We're here to see what E stands for, right? Let's get this styrofoam thingy out of the way. We don't need it, right? So because this canvas is poured glue, we can roll it back on itself to flatten it out. If you're diamond painting, is double-sided adhesive or mounted glue. Do not, do not roll your diamond painting in the other direction. You will mess up your glue and your painting and, and you're just gonna be sad and you're gonna get like rivers and bubbles and nobody's got time for that, nobody, right? So at the top of every rhinestone goddess creations canvas, you have her logo. At the top left, you have your legend. It tells you the number of, you know, that's like number one would be symbol P. So bag number one, you know, then you got like your symbol and then your DMC color going down there. The bottom left hand side, you have your thumbnail of the picture. The title of the painting E is for and the artist is Shay J. Reed. It is a 55 by 85 centimeter. It comes from rhinestone. Goddess Creations, right? She is just over there doing her thing. I do know uh, she talked about, I think she plans on, you know, getting boxes and all that. Like, she is just, like, upgrading little by little, you know. You do you, boo. So, you have her email as well as on the bottom right-hand corner, another legend, right? So, you might be wondering, Naomi, like, is it sticky? Am I going to put all my time and energy placing that little freaking drill down just for it to pop off? Well, first off, I don't know if you saw them square drills. Like, you ain't going to have problems with popping drills, okay? But is it sticky, right? Is it like that stage five clinger Psycho X that just won't leave you alone no matter how many years it has been, right? Ladies and gentlemen, go to the courthouse, get that restraining order because when I say your drills are not going anywhere, they ain't going anywhere. This painting is a stage five clinger. It's going to suck your drills in and hold on to them so tight. You have no worries. So let's see the drill field quality, right? So are the, my camera would focus. So from what I am seeing, you know, I don't see any problems. The symbols look clear, easy to read. There's a lot of J's in there. Hmm. Yes, so E is for, if you have not figured it out, this one is kind of easy. It's not like yesterday's, you know, the D. Yeah, yeah, I'm still on that D, I tell you. Anywho. But yes, E is for, it's either electricity, I think it's electrocuted, because like, honey, she fried herself. Like, it looks like you got smoke coming out of the sockets. Like, what did, what did she plug in? I don't, did she like stick a fork in the socket or something? Like, I don't, I, I don't see it, right? But she did it. Like, she electrocuted herself, fried her hair, the whole kit caboodle. This painting does have a frame around it. Some of Shay J. Reed's artwork, yeah, bit, 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 spit it out, cupcake. Some of Shay J. Reed's artwork does have frames that she will put around the image that kind of like somehow tie in to the picture, right? So this is like a flower frame, but you can see where the electrical shock and all that from the electrical sparks have gone on to the frame. I, I just, I love it. I love how she takes something that's like cute and adorable 
and makes it creepy. Like this one isn't, I guess, as creepy. But but you get where I'm going with it, right? I love how like her hair is fried. Is her bow a whole hot mess express over there? No, her bow's fine. So where would these ABs go, right? So there's three ABs. Let's find out where so they go. If you're new to diamond painting, I think I might have said this already. If not, we're gonna hear it again. AB stands for Aurora Borealis. It's just that, you know, you can see that little extra shiny coating on there. Like, ooh. So number 47 is the number two. And it looks like it's just kind of like sprinkled in the background here. We have some in her hair. Mm, where else is it at? We have some kind of like down here by her feet. Do we get any in the flowers? Not that I see. And then this light yellow, light yellow, light orange, yellow. I don't, I don't, whatever you want to call it. A, B. Symbol is that. That's like the little arrow. Homo wap it. It's kind of sprinkled in the background, just kind of like all over sprinkled in the background here. You have some of it like in the petals of the flowers down in here. And then this, I don't know what it is. This, this AB, like it's just, oh, I love it. It's so pretty. So this AB, this blue AB, it is just like, it is in her like dress. You got some, you know, it's like sprinkled all throughout her dress. You got some in her eyes there. Yes, yes, I, I am here for it. So you tell me, what do you think about the letter E? Would you electrocute yourself? I know, I, I freaking want it. Mm -mm, no, you couldn't pay me to do that. But anyway, if you're interested in getting this diamond painting, I will make sure to have Rhinestone and Goddess Creations Facebook linked down in the description box, as well as where you can go follow Shay J Reed herself on Facebook and Instagram. But with that said, guys, I'm gonna hop on out of here. If you're new to the channel and you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and ring that notification bell. And don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. And I'll see you next time, guys. Bye! Bye.